somebody's having a temper tantrum. Got scared. Because what I'm doing is I'm picking out a bunch of the toys in this cage so that I can redo this cage once everything from Bluebird Toys gets here. And, ooh, was he mad? You can be as mad as you want, dude. But some of these have to come out so that when I revamp this cage, I can set up, set it up differently. One of the things that I'm going to do is I'm, where his shelf is, right? There. I'm going to put a perch below it. That will give him some place to hang out, play with his toys. The only one that's going to be up high is the one that is his uh, nurse toy. And that's the one that is sitting closest to the mat with the rawhide and the wooden ball and the bell on the bottom. When I got baby, his previous owner told me flat out, he needs to have that toy in his cage all the time. Okay. And I did take it out once so that I could wash it and sanitize it and whatever. Oh my Lord and stars and bars, he was so so upset with mom. Holy moly. It was like, don't mess with me, mom. Just don't mess with me, mom. Now, the other thing that is coming out, if you see right up there, there's an oatmeal box. That is coming out. He's had fun with it, but it needs to... I can take what's in there for birdie toys and use them for other things. And a lot of toys that he, he doesn't really play with a lot, I'm going to take apart and rework into something different. Something that may be more of his interest now. The one thing I've got to find is a pencil sharpener because I need to un curl paper straws. One of its favorite things to play with is paper straws. Don't ask me why I haven't figured that out. But to un unfurl them, you have to run them through a uh, paper pencil sharpener and just rotate it off and it and you can just remake, you know, redo them. So, he got real upset now. He's finally calmed down a little bit. But boy, am I getting the stink eye. Woo! Thanks for watching. Have a great night. Bye.